Do you want a quick and easy way to mark student work? Then consider using the rubric in Microsoft Teams. If you want a guide on how to create a rubric in Teams, click on the video suggestion on the top of the screen. A rubric is a matrix or a table which you create which acts a bit like a level ladder for an assignment. Not only will it tell the students what they must do to achieve a certain grade, it will allow you to select the categories they have achieved after going through their work. After students have submitted their work in Microsoft Teams, you can open their work by clicking on their name and start to add comments and overall feedback. To see how you can do this, click on the video suggestion on the top of the screen. In this example, I have already added my comments and I've added some overall feedback to the student work. To allocate points or marks using the rubric, click on the name of the rubric you have attached to the assignment. This will show up the first section of the criteria you created in your rubric. You can read through the grade descriptors and click on the most relevant description. Since each description has a set number of marks allocated, every time you select a description, Teams will automatically allocate the marks to the overall assignment. Once you have finished this section, you have an option of providing some more feedback for this section by writing in the feedback box at the bottom. Once you are ready to allocate the marks to the next section of the rubric, click on the down arrow sign at the top of the rubric panel and select the next section. Once you have finished marking the assignment, you can then close the assignment and then return the work to the student so they can see the feedback and the grades they received. I hope this video has shown you how quick and easy it is to grade some work using a rubric. This not only helps speed up your marking, but it provides detailed feedback to the student so that they can improve their work. If you have found this video helpful, please give it a like, subscribe to the Teach Me channel and click on the notification bell so you know when more useful videos are released to enhance your teaching and learning.